Picture this, the world in the late 1950s, a time when television sets were cherished pieces of furniture, and families gathered around their screens for a dose of wholesome entertainment. In the midst of this golden era emerged the Donna Reed Show, a breath of fresh air that swept through living rooms and hearts alike. Can you recall that moment when you first stumbled upon the show? Perhaps you were flipping through channels, and there it was, a glimpse into the lives of the Stone family, with Donna Reed as the iconic mother figure. As you immersed yourself in the lives of Donna, her husband Alex, and their two children, Jeff and Mary, you found yourself transported to a world of relatable family dynamics, humorous mishaps, and heartwarming life lessons. Think back to those memorable scenes that left an indelible mark on you. Maybe it was Donna's unwavering wisdom as she navigated through everyday challenges, or the way Alex handled the ups and downs of his career with humor and grace. And who could forget the endearing sibling rivalry between Jeff and Mary? Those moments of laughter, empathy, and connection that the show evoked are timeless, a reminder of the enduring power of family-oriented storytelling. Now, let's take a step beyond the screen and delve into some fascinating tidbits about the Donna Reed Show. Beyond the on-screen charm, did you know that the show was a trailblazer in many ways? From tackling contemporary issues to portraying a strong, empowered female lead, the show broke barriers and set new standards for television during its time. So, as we journey back into the nostalgia-soaked world of the Donna Reed Show, prepare to uncover a tapestry of anecdotes that will deepen your appreciation for this classic gem. So, fasten your seatbelt as we embark on a journey through time, uncovering the hidden stories, behind-the-scenes magic, and impactful legacy of the Donna Reed Show. Get ready to relive those cherished memories and discover new layers of appreciation for this beloved series. Let's dive in. The Donna Reed Show, a 1958 TV series, originated as a family sitcom that followed the lives of the Stone family in the suburban town of Hilldale. Donna Stone, portrayed by Donna Reed, stood as the epitome of the ideal housewife, while her husband Alex Stone, played by Carl Betts, represented a progressive and supportive husband and father. The show offered a departure from traditional gender roles, presenting a more balanced and modern family dynamic. The series distinguished itself with its portrayal of relatable, everyday challenges within a warm and loving family environment. Donna's character blended charm, intelligence, and nurturing, showcasing her multi-dimensional approach to life as a wife, mother, and career woman. The Donna Reed show broke new ground with its depiction of a middle-class family. It subtly addressed various social issues while promoting family values. The show's emphasis on realistic conflicts and resolutions allowed viewers to connect with its characters on a personal level. This iconic show left an indelible mark on popular culture. Donna Reed's portrayal of Donna Stone set a new standard for the portrayal of women on television, influencing subsequent generations of female characters. The series paved the way for more nuanced family-oriented sitcoms and impacted the perception of family dynamics and entertainment. Now, delving into some interesting facts about the show, Donna Reed was not only the star but also an influential figure behind the scenes, participating in production decisions. Paul Peterson played Jeff Stone, the Stone's son, and his character became a relatable representation of teenage life. The show's suburban setting and the Stone family's comfortable lifestyle reflected the aspirations of the post-World War II American dream. The show's theme song, John is Theme, composed by Johnny Williams, became synonymous with the series and is recognizable to this day. The Donna Reed Show and the evolution of TV motherhood in the landscape of 1950s and early 60 Seconds family-oriented sitcoms, the Donna Reed Show stood as a pioneering emblem of change. Bucking convention, this series marked a significant shift by placing the mother at its focal point, a groundbreaking concept for its time. Premiering in 1958, the Donna Reed Show followed the life of Donna Stone, played by the eponymous actress, as she navigated the challenges of modern motherhood. The show's format was distinct, featuring Donna as a working mom, a registered nurse, who gracefully balanced her family responsibilities with her professional aspirations. This portrayal deviated from the prevailing norm of relegating mothers to supportive, background roles within their family dynamics. Beyond its innovative approach to the portrayal of motherhood, the Donna Reed show also had an unexpected influence on another TV favorite. 
The first season's opening credits of The Munsters, a supernatural sitcom featuring a quirky monster family, playfully parodied the iconic opening sequence of The Donna Reed Show. While Donna Reed's character lovingly sent off her family members with packed lunches, Yvonne DiCarlo's Lily Munster followed suit in a delightful twist. In recognition of its impact, The Donna Reed Show garnered accolades not only in audience reception, but also in industry acknowledgement. Dr. Alex Stone, portrayed by Carl Betts, who played Donna Stone's supportive husband and a pediatrician, earned his place as a beloved TV father. TV Guide ranked him 16 on its prestigious list of the 50 greatest TV dads of all time. His relatable and caring portrayal resonated with audiences, helping to solidify the show's legacy. While sitcoms of the era often followed traditional gender roles, The Donna Reed Show pioneered a more progressive and balanced representation of motherhood and family dynamics. Its influence on subsequent television programs remains palpable, as it paved the way for more nuanced portrayals of women and mothers on screen. In the ever-evolving landscape of television, The Donna Reed Show remains an indelible mark of innovation, reminding us that even in the black and white days of the 1950s, change could be vividly colorful. Pediatrician in a suit Unveiling the quirk in The Donna Reed Show in the annals of classic television, The Donna Reed Show holds a prominent spot, but a peculiar idiosyncrasy has emerged from its eight-year run that deserves a closer look. Amid the various iterations of opening credits, one detail about Carl Betts' character, Alex Stone, emerges as an incongruity. In a recurring visual, Stone departs his abode donned in a business suit, clutching a briefcase, a routine seemingly at odds with his profession as a pediatrician who typically sports a white lab coat while administering care from his home-based office. Unraveling this enigma reveals a subtle twist in storytelling. As the series unfolded, keen-eyed viewers might have noted Stone's exit from a room adjacent to the entrance, the very space that housed his medical practice, concealed behind pocket doors. The astute deviation, where his business attire coincided with hospital-bound days, was a nuance reflective of the character's dual responsibilities. A fitting tribute to a man juggling familial warmth and professional diligence, this subtle touch anchored the show's authenticity. However, beneath the surface, there lies a creative rationale. The Donna Reed Show, a cultural emblem of its era, maintained an adherence to authenticity. Viewers could discern a deeper level of care applied to the minutiae of each character's persona. Indeed, the nuanced portrayal of Stone's dual nature as both father and physician encapsulated the multifaceted essence of the show's narrative. Adding to the layers of intrigue, it emerges that Donna Reed herself, the eponymous lead, played a silent yet pivotal role off-camera. With her then-husband Tony Owen, Reed helmed the production company Todd On of California, which assumed the mantle of producer for the show. The imprint of her influence can be glimpsed in the show's themes, character dynamics, and the overall ambience that envelops the Stone family. Further contextualizing the show's ethos, the Donna Reed show ingeniously weaved product placements into its early years. Supermarket scenes became an arena for these endorsements, with Campbell's Soup, V8 Juice, Franco-American canned goods, and Johnson & Johnson wares, including their iconic baby powder, making appearances. Seamlessly integrating sponsors' offerings within the show's universe demonstrated a pioneering approach to commercial collaboration. In the end, it's these very anomalies, like a pediatrician attired in a business suit or a subtle nod to Reed's behind-the-scenes influence, that elevate the Donna Reed show from a mere sitcom to a captivating slice of cultural history. As the series' iconic themes of family, work, and authenticity continue to resonate with contemporary audiences, they serve as a testament to the enduring appeal of a show that dared to embrace the nuances of everyday life. Unveiling the quirks of the Donna Reed show, a glimpse behind the scenes in the annals of classic television, few series boast the iconic status of the Donna Reed show. Premiering in 1958, it charmed viewers with its heartwarming family dynamics and became a beloved staple of the era's sitcoms. Yet, beneath its polished veneer, peculiarities abound, illuminating the show's uniqueness. One standout quirk emerges in the recurring opening credits. Over the show's eight-year run, keen-eyed viewers might notice an incongruity involving Carl Betts' character, Alex Stone, a pediatrician. In a visual paradox, the character is shown departing the Stone residence attired in a business suit and clutching a briefcase, ostensibly headed to work. 
However, a twist of irony prevails. Dr. Stone actually conducts his medical practice from home, donning a white lab coat while tending to his patients. This curious contradiction is a subtle nod to the complexities of character portrayal and continuity in the television landscape of the time. Furthermore, the set of the Stone family's living room holds a fascinating history. This very living room set found new life as Major Nelson's abode in I Dream of Genie, a testament to the versatility of television sets and the resourcefulness of production crews. Beyond its journey to the magical realm, the living room set reappeared in the homes of the Mitchell family in Dennis the Menace, and, on multiple occasions, in the world of Hazel. The cyclical nature of television design and set reuse paints a portrait of collaboration and adaptation in the realm of production design. However, the show's most groundbreaking distinction was its role in revolutionizing family-centric sitcoms. Amidst the proliferation of family-oriented shows during the 1950s and early 60s seconds, the Donna Reed show stood as a trailblazer. It dared to shift the narrative lens, centering its focus on the mother, played by Donna Reed herself. A departure from the norm, the strategic decision carved a niche for the show, breathing fresh life into the traditional family sitcom structure. The Donna Reed show remains not only a cherished slice of television history, but a treasure trove of idiosyncrasies. From Carl Betts' enigmatic commute to the recycled living room set's cameo appearances, and the show's pioneering spotlight on the mother's role, it encapsulates the charm, creativity, and innovation of an era that shaped the small screen landscape. As the credits roll on this remarkable chapter of television, the legacy of the Donna Reed show endures, a testament to the power of quirk and innovation that leaves an indelible mark on pop culture. As we bid adieu to our journey through the enchanting world of the Donna Reed show, let's take a moment to savor the captivating echoes of a bygone era that this 1958 TV series has gifted us. The show, like a cherished time capsule, holds the essence of an era when family values and heartfelt moments danced in harmony across our screens. As you reflect upon the subtle nuances of the Stone family's daily life, the laughter that resonated within their cozy home, and the timeless lessons learned along the way, consider the way this series has woven itself into the tapestry of your own experiences. Perhaps you've seen shades of your own family dynamics within the stones, or found inspiration in Donna's grace and wisdom. Now, dear friend, the stage is yours. Share your treasured memories, the moments that made you smile, the lessons that touched your heart, and the ways in which the Donna Reed show has found a special place within your own story. Whether it's a chuckle-inducing escapade or a poignant life lesson, your unique perspective adds depth to the legacy of this beloved show. In this age where time marches ever onward, let's honor the past by keeping its treasures alive. Your reflections can breathe new life into the Donna Reed show, sparking conversations that bridge generations and kindling the warmth of nostalgia and all who are fortunate enough to hear your tale. Thank you, kindred spirit, for your time and your willingness to share a piece of your heart. Let your thoughts become a part of the rich tapestry of memories that surround the Donna Reed show, allowing its magic to endure for years to come. Until we meet again on the pages of shared stories and memories, take care and remember the past lives on in the stories we tell today.